Well, this is big because this is going to be our primary surveillance um, radar. And actually, I was just talking to the cabinet secretary, and it was kind of a bit nostalgic because when I was uh, the minister of um, natural resources and environment, um, uh, Stuart Leslie was reminding me that we were fighting for the Doppler system and radar that we got when I was the minister. Um, and we got it in 2007, um, right after I had resigned as the minister. But it's just a sense of, you feel like a sense of accomplishment that, that um, you got something for Belize. And now here we are, I must commend um, former minister Andre Perez. Um, who was the person driving force behind this, pushing to ensure that we can upgrade the system that we have? Um, tourism, as I mentioned, is, um, is the number one industry in the country, 45% of GDP. Of, um, so it is important for us to be ensure that our skies are safe at all times. But then there's another second reason why it was this important for us, because we know the issue of drug trafficking, that um, Belize is a used as a transit point. Um, we have many aircrafts that would fly and land in, in different parts of the country. Um, but now with this radar system, we'll be able to chuck it from far, from way bef before they get into our airspace. Certainly it is a monumental uh, feat and an accomplishment for the Ministry of Civil Aviation, of course in partnership with our ministry and the Ministry of Defense uh, in terms of securing this uh, primary surveillance radar. It's a huge day for Belize, uh, as the CEO rightly mentioned, it means we have safer skies now over Belize. Do you have an estimate for how much was spent? Um, we're talking about somewhere in the vicinity of maybe 12, 12 million dollars with our logistics, the, the, the radar, the movements, the, 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 um, we had the additional incurrence expenses because of the clash that we have with the, the, the amplification of the, the, um, the radar uh, with the radar of um, med service. So they had to do some kind of walls and firewalls and things and that costs more to do. But again, um, Indra is, um, came through for us and uh, we had to pursue real hard. Um, deadlines need, need to be met. And, um, but we as a government have to say that it has to happen. We can't be just saying it's going to be delayed. We're going to be doing it next year. Something is coming up. You know, um, There was a time when the radar was being allocated for another country and we were saying, no, it's, it's for us. Um, so it, it, it entailed a lot of um, negotiations, dialogue. Uh, being on those phones and attending meetings and a lot, lot of Zoom meetings, um, why it's not happening. Some days we're frustrated that I wonder if this is going to come true. So all of that in a nutshell today, it's really a beautiful day and a good day for this country that we're celebrating today. Very historical.